Hi everybody, it's me again. Um, I have been extremely lazy lately and not making videos. I'm not sure how I think I'm going to get more views on YouTube by not doing videos. Um, so today I'm just doing something really, really simple. Um, I'm going to be heading out the door in a little bit. So I've already got my foundation, I've already got my concealer, my powder. I'm just going to do a really, really simple eye. Um, it's really warm out, so I don't want a whole lot of eye makeup. Um, lately, I haven't been wearing much for um, foundation, really, either. Um, just a little bit of concealer and a powder and some mascara and some eyeliner. That's what I've been wearing lately. It's just too warm to have layers on your face. Um, let's get going. First, what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill in my eyebrows. So we, we know how to do this. I just follow the natural line of my brows. Okay, so after we have our eyebrows um, filled in, I'm gonna go ahead and do a really, really simple, simple, everyday, natural looking eye. Um, so what I'm going to put on first is my primer, which I'm using MAC Paint Pot. Um, you can use any sort of primer that you like. If you don't have a primer, just go ahead and use a little bit of foundation or concealer. Just something on your lid to help your eyeshadow stay put. So I'm just dipping my finger in and all over the eyelid right up to your brow. Alright, so you can pick any sort of um, natural color that you like. I want something with a little bit of shimmer, I think, today. So I'm using this palette again, this uh, Clever Cat Magic Eyeshadow. Still not sure what is magic about it, but I like it. So I'm going to use this light shade right, ooh, right here. So I'm just taking an eyeshadow brush, one that looks like this, and I'm just going to fill that right up and apply it right on the half circle like we always do. This does have a shimmer to it, which is what I'm looking for um, for today, a natural color with a little bit of a shimmer. Let me grab this mirror. I would say this color would be maybe one to two shades darker than my skin tone, which is kind of something you, you'd want to have um, for a natural look, um, so that it looks like you're still, you do have a little bit of makeup on, but it's not overdone. So I'm just going to make sure that I have enough color on there. Perfecto. And I'm going to take my smushy brush, just like that. I'm going to get a little bit of that same color on my smushy brush and put that in the crease. So we're just going to take this right in the crease and windshield wiper it right in. Now that is pretty simple, so do the same thing uh, with the other eye. Perfect. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back with the shadow brush and I'm going to put some right on the tip of it and run it along underneath, um, underneath my eye. And wipe it right underneath. Doesn't have to be super neat because it's not really a dark shade so it's only going to give a little bit of a shadow. And the same thing over here. I generally don't go right into the corner of the inner corner of my eyes. Um, right now I have quite a bit of dry skin right in here so if I put a, too much product it just looks cakey and flaky and not very attractive so I'm not running it the whole way in. Just pretty much three quarters of the way in. 
Now I'm going to do some liner. Now I am just using this Avon Glimmer Sticks, which I reviewed in the last video. Um, I like this for liner. It is a brow definer. Um, I find it's a really nice natural color for liner. So all I'm going to do is run this along the top and the bottom, and then we're going to use a brush to kind of smoke it out so it's not such a harsh line. So I'm just you can see I'm just running that not I'm not doing anything super neat now I'm going a little bit um a little bit thicker than I would with a fluid line like a like a liquid eyeliner because we are gonna smoke it out so you can just do this quick underneath I don't go as thick underneath but Now this is definitely a makeup you can do really quick in the morning, like five minutes in the morning. Um, this is something you can also do for the people that don't wear foundation and powders and such. You can go ahead and just do this on your eyes, it's just going to make your eyes pop. I say if you have great skin, don't bother to cover it up. Um, so I'm just taking um, an angled brush like this and I'm just going to smoke out that line a little bit. Just so that it doesn't look like we just penciled in a line. I usually smoke it out. If I find I need a little bit more, I'll add some more and smoke that out as well. So I'm going to go ahead and do the other eye. So I'm just finishing smoking everything out. I've gone over it a couple of times just to get a nice dark brown color. So see what we've done? It still looks quite natural. So now I'm going to do, I'm going to do mascara and I'm just using my two faves right now, which is Fiber Rich and Plush. I'm kind of just trying to use these up before I get some new kinds. So I've done one coat. While I'm waiting for that to dry and apply another coat, I'm going to do cheeks. Now for cheeks, I'm using this NYX Cream Blush. It's in Rose Petal and I'm using the my stippling brush from e.l.f. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to pat that in there and I'm going to I'm going to stipple the excess just on my hands so that when you put it on you're not going to have a big glob of pink. So I'm just going on my apple and right through here. So I apply it just like so. But cream blush goes on so natural. And you can work it right into your um, your foundation or whatever it is you have on your face for products. On my lips, I'm just using this Hello Kitty lip gloss. It's just pink, kind of shimmery. It doesn't really have a color. It's more or less just, more or less just a, just a clear gloss. Okay, so after that, just add um, your favorite bronzer. Um, if you have a highlighter, you can add your highlighter just to your C here. Um, it's really up to you what else you want to add. But as far as the eyes, it's really simple. So, yeah. Sorry I've been slacking on the tutorials. <laughs> I've meant to make so many more, um, but I've just had some other things to do lately. And I have some great news coming up really soon. Um, I am going to be selling some cosmetics, and I'm very, very excited about that. I will put the link below of the website that you can go on and order from me. Um, yeah. So have a wonderful day, everybody, and I will talk to you soon.